Good afternoon guys and welcome back to my channel. Before we jump straight into this afternoon's haul, uh, I thought that I would showcase a few bits and pieces that are new around my room that have finally arrived. Some of them have, were mentioned back in my first ever vlog slash video on YouTube ever. That was early October and it's finally arrived about two days ago. And here it is. It's my lovely brand new chair that I got from DFS for about £300. It was a bit of a investment, but I just thought it's so big and so comfy. And since I'm spending the rest of the university from home and lectures, online lectures, I thought I might as well get a nice big comfy chair. Excuse the mess on the side. I have cleaned up this afternoon, which is why I'm starting the video so late. But, you know, it is what it is. There's the whole stack ready to go. And my new light fitting came oh. I was so excited about this only because I think I mentioned it that one light in my last fitting was just completely cracked and broke and it just left me with two. So, and I think this one, because it's chrome, it makes the room a bit look, well, it looks cleaner, I think. And it goes with my little light over there that I got from Ikea. So I just, and I think that my room currently just looks so much tidier and cleaner. Obviously, excuse the mess over there. And my photo frame that needs to go on the wall to make this plain wall look a bit more like it's got something to it. Right guys, so please excuse the dressing gown. It's only because I'm going to get be getting changed an awful lot. So to start the haul off, we're going to do the misguided bits and pieces first and I actually ordered myself some new gym things and this was actually before gyms were short and I think this parcel came last week it was delayed a little bit because of some postmen around our area got coronavirus so they had to self-isolate um, but I'm still exercising home exercises in lockdown so I actually got this cute little chocolate sports bra I actually wanted this whole chocolate coloured set but they didn't have my size at the time so I decided to get the chocolate sports bra and then the pastel pink gym matching kit to go with and I'm excited to see how this combination goes I just think it's such a cute combo pastel pink and chocolate so I feel like their sportswear is just amazing sorry the mirror is over here so I'm like is it nice is it not it's this really cute pastel pink colour. I have still got the tags on because this is actually the first time I'm ever trying them on. Normally I panic and try them on before I do the hauls, but I thought, no, let's just do the haul. Like a true fit to size. Do they fit or not? Um, I feel like I haven't explained why I've got so much more into my fitness and buying loads of gym stuff. And there is a story to it. And it's not much of a story. I'm making it sound 10 times more dramatic than it is. But to me, it's so exciting. So, yeah. Obviously, need to lose a lot more weight. But that's what gym kits are for. And I think that the chocolate brown sports bra is perfect with these. Because it just... You can't really see it. And it's a nice colour. So, actually... Loving the sports gear. I think it has got the writing misguided ms what is that gd yeah misguided very nice so i am currently crouched down because i have to step back and show you my outfit so i just have to toddle over here um it was james's birthday of the weekend he loved his presents i have got a little video of him revealing his presents because he wanted to show everybody hello welcome to my 22nd Birthday. Uh, I've got a few things that'll be very spoiled. Um, so I'll see if I can fit it in. It's only because he was playing his favourite singer ever, Jerry Cinnamon, in the background. So I might be done for copyright for it. But um, he loved all of his presents and he had a fabulous day in lockdown. And as a birthday present from his mum and my dad, they pooled their money together. Uh, and we got to pick a holiday of our choosing with that money and to celebrate our birthdays we have booked the Maldives for August this year and I'm too excited so obviously I'm trying to get in shape for the Maldives because I want some nice pictures 
obviously I do. So, and I, obviously I'd be wearing a bikini all the time because it's hot. It's 32 degrees in August. So, you know, what are you doing? So the next outfit is also a gym outfit. Now I never wear short arm tops besides that pastel pink one that I just brought, brought, bought. So um, I have got the pastel blue color in it. Now this one is long sleeve and the bra, the sports bra is the same as the chocolate one just in this gorgeous sky pastel blue color. So this is the exact same gym kit as the pastel pink one just in a really nice sky blue colour which I think pastel sky blue is becoming my favourite colour recently it's just so nice and so pretty so it's the same again it's got the misguided right and long again I've got the tags on because I haven't tried any of them on but again I'm quite happy so the next bits that I got from misguided are these cute little leather shorts I actually wore these a few days before my birthday with some tights because I just thought they looked really cute. I've not actually tried these on yet, but I just saw the little pockets dangling by the ends and I just thought they look really cute. And these are the other leather shorts with the little cute pockets in the side. I don't think you can you put anything in the pocket. Oh, the actual pockets. Oh, well they'll come in handy, won't they? really cute. I just put it together with a black bodysuit and um, I couldn't really be bothered to change the top because nobody tells you, no one is completely honest, that when you do these hauls how much effort it takes to do them. Like I am exhausted. Why is it this hard? I don't know. Should it be this hard? Probably not. Okay, so it turns out we were actually done with the misguided thing. Now on to the pretty little thing bits. So, so I ordered this really nice white under t-shirt dress. And I, this is actually in the maternity section. I did get the extra small in it, in this caramel vest. And I think I'm just going to pair it with my heart tights again and my Kurt Garg boots. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Kurt Gaga, Kurt Geiger, I don't know. Um, that I featured in my last video. So this is the outfit put together. I actually, I actually, I actually didn't realise that this white t-shirt dress would need ironing. You think I would realise that, but I didn't. Um, so I've just styled it with my heart tights and my Kurt boots. And I think this is a really cute outfit all together. I think it's perfect for a nice little afternoon walk, coffee date, going out for food. I just, I think it's really cute. I don't know where I think I'm going with all these nice clothes because we're in lockdown. We can't actually go anywhere, but it's good to be prepared. I can use, I can use them. I can wear them when we come out of lockdown. Why is it when I make these videos, I can't talk? There's nothing to be nervous about, there's no one here. So we're now onto the comfy section of the Pretty Little Thing haul. I I think these pyjamas are so cute. They are loungewear but I'm going to use them as both loungewear and pyjamas because look how cute they are. So I do actually have a similar set from Pretty Little Thing that I bought at least over two years ago now. But they are a short sleeve tee and shorts and they are a lighter grey. Maybe not. But this is long sleeve and long pants and I just think it's really cold outside. And I really like stars. That doesn't really justify it, does it? So this cohort of loungewear is just so nice. It has the really extra thick ties with pretty little thing going all the way down it in a nice light grey and white matching little top to jumper i think it has a hood does it have a hood <gasps> it has a hood i mean i don't look great in it but you know um i think this is really super cute again it probably wasn't needed but it is needed so to show you this really nice extra stretchy fabric it's like a wool 
almost but it's so fleecy and so comfy and I'm wearing this after this video is done. So the last thing that I bought from Pretty Little Thing is this really nice black jumper. I've just paired it with the misguided gym pants because as much as that loungewear was really really comfy I do have to do my exercise today. I have to. Come on. So I can justify this purchase because it is freezing. If you go for a jog out there, you're risking your own life. If you don't put layers on, it's your own fault. Don't come crying to me in my nice jumpers. I'm not justifying it, am I? But it is really cute. It has a pretty little thing written on it. I mean, not that that's the truth, but everyone knows it's a website it's a clothing website so it's fine but i think this is really really nice so i'm happy to stay in this before i go and do my exercises it's comfy it, it, it is baggy but it's fitted at the same time and these misguided gym wear i actually don't buy gym wear from anywhere else besides misguided because i think it's really good so guys that is the end of this haul i hope you enjoyed it i mean it wasn't exactly the most professional haul that i have seen or witnessed ever because i do watch a lot of them on youtube but i try and be myself on the video so i am sorry and yeah i've told you all my news i have a nice show joe thing maldives all the clothes so i think we're good to leave I need to get better at this. So I'll see you on my next video. Bye guys!